the truth. There were two very different sides to the New Year's Day speech from the North Korean leader Kim Jong-un uh, this year. There was the usual nuclear defiance, but on top of that, there was also a conciliatory tone taken when talking uh, about South Korea, a, a great uh, difference from what we heard uh, last year. Usually these speeches give some kind of indication of what we can expect from North Korea throughout the year, and this one is certainly an interesting speech. First of all, focusing, though, on what we did expect from Kim Jong-un. He actually declared that uh, 2017 was the year when North Korea completed the nuclear capabilities. He also said that North Korea is a peaceful nuclear state and they have no intention of using their nuclear weapons as long as there is no aggression shown towards them. He also had a very specific message for the United States. America will never be able to provoke war or attack us. The entire continent of America is within reach of our nuclear attack. They must never forget the nuclear button is placed on my desk at all times. They must realize correctly that this is not a threat but reality. So we're certainly seeing a more conciliatory tone towards South Korea. This time last year, we heard uh, from North Korean officials suggesting that they wanted uh, to talk to the United States, or at least they wanted to see what kind of relationship they could have with the new Trump administration. We heard nothing of that this time around. They are focusing now on the South Korean side, uh, saying that uh, North and South Korea must work together to alleviate the tensions, also saying uh, that if they work together, they will be able to alleviate those tensions uh, without... Got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight M's in my bank account.